Um, my name is Ben Coppolo. I'm a photographer and I mainly specialise in shooting weddings. Fusion Photography is uh, a high-end boutique photography studio. It's, it's in high demand. It's one of the, the most highly regarded wedding studios in Australia. The thing with photography is having a website is pretty much mandatory. <laughs> But when you're dealing with the public, your website as a photographer literally is your shop front, so you, you cannot survive without it. Because I work from home, um, my website becomes my storefront. It's absolutely essential. A lot of what I do can be done online, and photography being a very visual medium, um, you know, people are looking to see your portfolio and your work, so of course you know, online or a website is the perfect way to showcase uh, photos and give them that, that visual feedback on what they're looking for. So a lot of the work for these albums are, are done online, that's another really good use for, for online. Um, we do all the design work uh, via online, we have a, an online virtual album that I can get made up and sent to the clients and then they can uh, make notes directly on the virtual album to me which then comes to my computer which then I can liaise with the, the graphic designer and we can go back and forth all three of us collaborating all, all via online. The client never has to come in to, to do things physically. Um, all they have to do is come and pick up the physical album when it's finished. So that's another great use for, um, for the internet. So get, getting my website started, um, you know, it's always hard starting from scratch. Uh, because when you start a business, I guess you're fairly cash flow poor. So my first website was just a basic template website. There's a lot of companies online that offer photographers uh, ready-made portfolio websites. A few years ago I bit the bullet and I paid for a, a company to actually design a custom site for me. And the advantage of that is I could get the look and feel and, and portray the kind of attributes of my business that I wanted to get across to the clients in a way that I couldn't do with, with a cheap template website. It's a time consuming thing to, to maintain your online presence. Um, if you want it to work effectively, you can, you can put a website up there and leave it, um, but you need to keep working on it to, to make it relevant as time goes on. But to do it properly uh, with a web designer, it could be months of work, laying everything out, designing it, sorting it how you want it. But then on an ongoing basis, I probably spend at least a couple of hours a week. Um, whether that might be uploading photos to clients' galleries, it might be putting some new work on the blog, it might be putting some stuff on social media, it might be changing some of the, the photos in my portfolio. But you need to, I think, spend at least a few hours a week keeping your online presence up to date and making sure it's, uh, it's doing what you want it to do. I've only just recently uh, created a Facebook business page and that's linked with my website and my blog. And again, I use that as a tool, as a branding tool. So I'm, I'm talking about Fusion and what I'm doing, my projects, I'm showing my latest work there. And, and that way, not only are my clients seeing it, but they're able to tell their friends about it. And I, I still am exploring how it all works. <laughs> but I think it's an important tool for anyone who's looking to, to use um, the online world as a marketing tool. Because what brides tend to do is they will, they will surf and they'll look at literally 100 photographers' websites uh, and mine, for, for whatever reason, stands out from the crowd. It, it just helps them do that, that sorting process. They couldn't physically go and see you know, 100 photographers, but they can quickly review 100 photographers online and because my website stands out, that helps me get onto their short list. Eventually they'll come in and see me personally. You have to learn how to market the website just as you would market a, a physical shop front or premises. And there's, there's so many ways of doing that. I mean, you can mention your website in all your other marketing material, like your business cards, your flyers, and your magazine ads or whatever. But then there's a whole lot of things you need to do in the online world to to make people know that you're there. Um, that's probably one of the big lessons I learned. It's probably one of the mistakes I made early on was I splashed a lot of money out on things like Google AdWords or bridal directories without really knowing you know, what I was getting in return. In the future, maybe I won't have to have any photos stored literally on my computer. 
If I can also access my photos in a cloud anywhere I am, so I can work when I'm interstate or overseas, that would be amazing.